Hi guys, welcome to my channel g3fashion.com and we have a video on mix and match outfits. We're going to show you how you can wear one outfit in two different ways with mix and match style tips. So here goes. If you're still new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and see more videos on Indian fashion on our channel. So the first one is this printed lehenga choli which is in a bustier blouse it's a beaded bustier now you can see it's been styled with a plain lehenga and gathers even the dupatta has been kept very simple which is a statement choli so what you can do is restyle it in a different way where you can pair the same bustier with a different bottom like what we've done here is taken a base color of a sharara from the bustier and added a printed jacket to match the print you can also go with another jacket style or a dupatta if you like or even a plain cover up if you like so this is how you can style the lehenga in the second style way Number two is styling this tissue lehenga with a choli which is heavily beaded. If you notice that this is a bias cut lehenga and it's also got a dupatta which is in the same cut box style. So what you can do is restyle the lehenga in a different way instead of the choli. So let's take a look at how you can change the look of this outfit by adding a short peplum kameez or a short tunic style in the same color as your lehenga so you can see that this one is beaded and it's semi flared it's not full flared but it does go along and it gives you an indo western look Number three is styling this Indo Western in a solid color in a three piece. It's a flared plazo with a crop top and an open peplum jacket that you're looking at. It's an layer styled look. So what we've done is just added jumkas to style the look. Now, if you want to restyle this look, all you have to do is ditch the jacket and add on a sari in the same base color. There's a little bit of contrast with yellow and green and we've draped it in a pan style sari look. So all you've done is added an overlayer by removing the overlayer jacket or the shrug for this look. And you can always do this even with a sharara bottom as well. Number four is styling this anarchy plazo set in a different way. So the first one is in this full look which has the same type of plazo and you can see it's got a dupatta also in the same color and the anarchy is a bit short. So what you can do over here is style it in a different way by ditching the anarchy kameez and putting on a crop top blouse or something like this in a contrast color or the same dark color. Add on the same dupatta for a harmonizing look and a jacket style we've added the same dupatta in a jacket style you can also watch our video in the description to see how you can make that number five is adding a white on white look now this is a thread work concept in a chicken curry look even the dupatta is styled in the same work concept so to style this in a different way we've added a kurta which has the same white work detailing in the hemline there's a little bit of work in the placket and it's a soft tint of aqua so you don't want to overpower it we've added the same dupatta or you can even go without a dupatta for an indo western look number six is styling this pretty anarchy which is in an ombre effect all we've done is added a dupatta in a lightweight look and this is your first look for this outfit now to change the look of this outfit all you have to do is ditch the dupatta and add on a kameez or a short tunic style kurta which matches the color of the ombre effect which is yellow so you can see we've also added a dupatta which matches the kameez to harmonize the whole look so this is again a sharara style of a dress so this completes how you can style and mix and match one outfit in a different way or one outfit in two ways we hope you like the video if you are still new to the channel don't forget to subscribe to the channel and also hit the bell button you can shop for the collection on g3fashion.com or you can also use g3 plus video shopping service thank you so much for watching and we'll see you again next time